The Southern Heritage Museum is constantly searching for ways to highlight old treasures from the past. While doing some digging, they found a railroad gang car used in the military training days on Camp Claiborne, the only Army-owned railroad back in the early 1900s. Back in the day, they used it for track maintenance and track inspections. It's a small car that they would put a crew of people on to ride down the rails to inspect them. So we picked it up with the intentions of using it for that. Upon gaining more information, they decided to go another route. The decision was made then to restore this and actually use it as an exhibit since we housed the Claiborne exhibit here on the museum grounds. Fitting for both the railroad and the car, giving visitors an even better picture of what it was like working on Camp Claiborne. Glenn Armand and his grandson are the volunteers behind displaying this part of history. Totally disassembled it, changed all the broken parts and pieces, rewired it, and repainted it to match the military scheme that was out here keeping the legacy alive for years to come. Miranda Thomas, ABC 31 News, that works for you.